Hey guys, it's Comcalio Studios here, and we have an absolutely huge teaser from Six Flags Great Adventure, which was just posted minutes ago. I wanted to take a couple minutes before I started filming just to analyze all these numbers. This is giving me huge reminiscence of the Fiesta Texas teaser campaign with all the numbers and addition. So let's break this down. Number by number, the totals, what all of this could mean. And it's actually a lot more straightforward than it looks. So right here we have 4 plus 50 plus 48 plus 15, plus 24, plus 10, plus 436 equals. First and foremost, when you add all those numbers together, you get 587. Now, I don't know what that could really have relation to. It could be the track length in meters, which if you translate that to feet, would then be almost 2,000 feet. I think it's a little short to be track length, of course, depending on the size of the coaster, but we can definitely break down all the add-ins and really figure out what this means. So for one, we have four. I think four could very definitely be inversions. Four inversions, it's not a ton, but it's definitely not super small either. I think that's a fair number. 50, obviously, is the 50th anniversary of Great Adventure. That kind of goes without saying. It's the 50th season of operation, the 50th anniversary of the park. 48. 48 could definitely be the 48-inch height requirement. That's something that's very possible. That would definitely help narrow down the options of coasters. I know Intamins, their uh, multi-launch coaster model, their height requirement kind of fluctuates. I don't know that it's 48 inches. I'll have to fact check that after I film the video, but that's definitely a possibility as that's the only number I could really see it representing. 15 would be 15th coaster. Great Adventure currently has 14 operating roller coasters, so this one would be the 15th. 24 being for the year 2024 that's the year that this coaster is being added and then we have the last two numbers 10 could be 10 airtime moments i think it has something to do with a certain ride element probably something along those lines i don't really see it being anything else and then we have 436 this is the one number i really can't figure out i definitely don't think it's going to be 436 feet tall i think that's very unrealistic and I really don't know what else this number could be. Maybe 436 riders per hour, but that's really small and that'd be a very weird number to put in there. So if you guys have any differing ideas on what these add-ins could represent, please let me know. And then of course we have the total, which is 587. Truly, I do not know what that would be. I just can't put my finger on what that would represent. Again, if it was capacity riders per hour, I think that's just too small for a ride going to Great Adventure. But that's not all. In the background, you can see a lot of little diagrams in the back. And I think that these definitely have some form of a representation. In the top left, you see a bar graph. And you can't really see too much of it, so I'm not thinking too much into it. Up in the top right, you see a, another bar graph, this time with all the bars full. And they're increasing exponentially with an arrow pointing that way. So that's definitely something that could mean something. Bottom left, we have part of a diagram with people attached to some sort of a rectangular shape. It kind of gets cut off in the side of the picture, so we can't really look too much into that. At the bottom of the screen, I really cannot tell what that is. If you guys have any ideas, let me know. And then we have in the bottom right, another sort of graph, and this one has two spikes shown in the graph. One of them has the number 91, and the other has the number 200. So is it possible that these are the heights of two of the elements on the coaster? I don't know. I don't know the size of this coaster. I don't know how big of a coaster we're looking at. But that is all for today's teaser from Six Flags Great Adventure. This is by far the most exciting one to me, as it definitely has a lot to break down in it. If you guys have any differing ideas or anything along those lines as to what this teaser could represent, please let me know down in the comments. And make sure you like the video if you enjoyed, and subscribe to Hollywood Studios so you don't miss any new teasers from Six Flags Great Adventure. With that being said, I'm Con for Hollywood Studios, and I'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye, guys.